it's me and today is a lovely day to check out some creative things that people have done. So this is how they made an Among Us card. So these are all the pieces to it. Pop the little crewmate on a black card and then cut it and then oh you have the base of the card and then you have the bottom half and then you have the piece of meat. It's a sticker and then cut it. Whoa. It's so insanely cute. I'll freak out if somebody gave me this for my birthday. <laughs> They took a coin and they just sliced right through it. Goodbye, five. And I thought they were gonna make a necklace out of it, like one of those trendy coin necklaces, but no, they're making a ring out of it. And look at this, the way they just carved it, filed it down like it's some acrylic nails, polished it to absolute shine. Wow, we broke a Coke bottle for this? They're making a fake diamond out of glass from a broken Coke bottle. No way that can be the same thing. That ain't the same thing. That diamond is a paid actor. I cannot believe this tomfoolery right now that I am witnessing. They made that out of a coin and a Coke bottle? Uh, I'm a little sus. I love art TikTok. And then I came across this, where they're just painting, right? And it looked a little messy on the back. And then they flip it over and then, wha-bam! It looks like it's printed. Whoa! This is so insanely cool. <sighs> I want one of these. Where can I buy one of these? And it's like painted on glass. I think this works like pancake art. Like you do certain layers first and then fill them in. And then, oh, it makes sense in my head. But if you know how pancake art works, it's kind of like this. Speaking of pancake art, you see, you do the darkest layer first, like the line layer. And then you see how they did that? And then you flip it over and it's a bootleg emoji. But I believe it's the same concept. We make a Mr. Bean out of a bean. It's clay. It's not actually a bean, it's clay. Oh, what he painted the eyes. No, sir. Literally came to life. I thought he put a towel on his head. <laughs> like when TikTok boys pretend to be girls. Oh, and the body. Whoa. Oh, no, he's naked. Oh, no, not the butt. You gonna do the front too? No, I didn't think so. Was the crack necessary? And then the, whoa. It's crazy how it just like wraps on it. Pop that head on. Whoa. Now bake him, preserve him for eternity. My dude got more skill in his pinky nail than I do in my whole entire hand. The way he molded those eye hollows was just like, skirt, skirt. Yes, ma'am. You guys know what to do, right? No, I don't. Is that the vegan teacher? They make it, oh it is! They make it her on an egg. Oh, y'all were carving an egg that still had the yolk in it. Oh, you ballsy, you ballsy. Oh, they just sucked it on out. And then made a night light. <laughs> okay, do me next. I don't even know. You could carve an eggshell with that much detail. If you guys don't know the vegan teacher, all she does is like make ukulele songs about why you shouldn't eat McDonald's and why you shouldn't eat ice cream. So carve her on an egg and make it a night light. The absolute most respectful disrespect. I respect that. We made a mold of us holding toes. So, you see, these two best friends are just like, went like that, but with their toes. Catch me on my next day off. I'm trying to do this with my friends. After they did the first step, they filled it up, and lo and behold, the mold. Some quality dining table decor. Just their feet intertwined. Bro, how do you even do that? Y'all gotta have long toes for that. Oh, wait, I have long toes. It'll probably work. Y'all remember Kaiba from Yu-Gi-Oh? Upgrade. Well, this is him now. They painted Kaiba's head on the PS4. Oh, it's perfect because it's like the PS4 literally built like him. Like his vest and how it's pointy. Uh, that's actually pretty cool. <gasps> how do they do that? They made kiwis into Mike Wazowski kiwi. And they're all different expressions, bro. This is so cool. Is that a chocolate chip as the eye? This is blowing my mind right now. They look so juicy. I just want to <laughs> devour. Absolutely delicious. I had no idea. The plastic part of the controller just like pops off just like that. I mean, how else will they make custom controllers? But anyways, they drew on it and then hand painted it. And then you got this sick design. Spray it and then pop it back on. Wow. Pretty cool. Spent 102 hours making the sculpture. It's been like a mighty fine piece of meat. Steak? We making a steak? A fake one? I mean, they actually baked it for real. Does that make it a real steak? No. Just because you bake it doesn't mean you can't eat it. Oh, and the plate. The plate is also a paid actor. Oh, so the whole meal. Steak, baked potato, plate. It's all fake. It's clay. Is this how they make those fake food props? Looking like an Outback Steakhouse commercial. 
On TikTok, I found this water droplet art and it's super cool, but also super simple and anybody can do it. So you just take water droplets. So you kind of have to let it drop on the paper gently. You must be very gentle. And then keep the paint pretty thin and then drop the color. And then the water droplets are just like, they suck it up, absorb the color. Paint them whatever color you'd like. Oh, they're so satisfying. I just want to like ruin them. What happens when it dries? There's no way to preserve them like this. Will they ever dry? They kind of look like Skittles. Like I just like slide them right off the page. But what's the point if you can't eat them? So they built a mini house. But look at it. Ain't, ain't nothing mini about this house. It's even got spiral stairs, a front porch. And then when you go inside, look, this does not look like a mini house. It has a whole entire kitchen. What, half this house a kitchen? Or half this kitchen a house? Oh, you got a little dining room. You got the bedroom upstairs. Bro, how does it look so tiny on the outside? And then you have all of this. You even have an upstairs. This is insane. Look how little it looks. It's so little. Can Home Depot start like selling these? I'm buying them for my dogs. You know where they would go? Under the house. They would literally sit under the house. Printed. Nice printer. It's not a drawing. Hold on. So you see when I was four, five, six, this is how I would draw. Dang, you could draw like that at seven years old? Hey, she's really good. At eight, 10, 11, age 13, you be drawing like that? Whoa, I wonder how old they are now. What, how you go from 14 to 15 and now it's like, bam. It's like puberty also hit your art. It just glowed up in such a way. Whoa, that Nutella be looking. Oh, forget the Nutella, the balloons. The balloons! You told me that's not printed? Oh, the humongous piece of meat. Oh, it's glorious, Mwah. beautiful. It's crazy how drawing skills can just like level up over the years. That didn't happen to me and I was drawing my whole life. Some people got it, some people don't. So take a bottle, cut it open. Are we making bottle spaghetti? Nope. Perhaps a little sleeve. A pouch, I think they're making a pouch. Wow, so it's a little pouch. Pop your charger through it and then it holds your phone. So if you only have those chargers that are like high up, with no place to put your phone, not gonna lie, it's pretty genius. That's a really good idea. And it's so simple and you could probably do it with like any plastic bottle. You know, it's always risky business. Making some sand art. My dude didn't want to make a castle. He made a whole entire alligator. Droppings and all. Is, is that the poo poo? Did it do poo poo? You know, all it takes is just one wave. So you really took up half the beach for this. I'm surprised Karen didn't like walk on it and sit on it. Oh, look, the perfect spot. <gasps> oh, so satisfying. You see the way that they just like took the clay and just smoosh. Big fat boosh. Oh, that was nice. Looking like a SpongeBob clam. <gasps> They're making a living room out of this. Oh, the rug and then the little couches. Oh, I cannot handle this level of cute. The mighty urge to just squish it. Okay, now that's more my kind of sandwich. <laughs> a slap booty sandwich. When you put the mustard size, it just like make a smoke on the bologna booty. I ain't eating the crack though. This is how to make a lava lamp. Vegetable oil, pour it in a vase, vase, however you want to say it. Add some water, add some food coloring. Is that it? Is really that simple? Are you gonna mix it or not? Oh, Alka-Seltzer. That'll make it fizzy. Watch the magic. Whoa! Like a red blood cell explosion. I've seen other ones like this where they take a light and then they put it on the bottom of it so it like actually like lights up. I didn't know it was this simple though. My dude's like, come, 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 come. Come into my cave. Is this a tree? This ain't from BC. He just carved the whole entirety of the inside of the tree. This ain't no caveman's doing. It's literally the inside of a tree. Y'all went to town on it. Carved it like a holiday ham. They took a tree. We make a tree art today. Straight out of wood. Oh, the inside of it is red. So they're filing it down. Oh, and then the lacquer. And then that's how they make those really shiny high gloss tables. So it all started as a tree. Super thick trunk. I've seen these tables. And how much they cost. So that'll be $10,000, please. This is another tree trunk art. So after they've carved everything, they dumped all the dust. And then you got this. They hand carved the dragon. Wow. The Shimada brothers could never. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below and let me know which one of these was the most creative. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click. Click. And subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh! I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.